Hey y'all, this is Brett, and tonight I'd like to share with you some recent progresses that I've made over the last couple of months that are really exciting for me. And I wrote them down on a Facebook page, so I'm going to post, so I'm going to uh, just read them to you. For the first time in my life, I'm able to consistently take aggressive antiviral, antibacterial, anti-parasitical herbs. I recently finished off a bottle of extra strength grapefruit seed extract tablets and now I'm taking two 50 milligram olive leaf extract capsules from Gaia a day. I'm also taking lots of other great herbal formulas and the kicker is that I'm handling it without getting overly sick. And I'm doing plenty of sauerkraut, and primal defense as well. This is a huge accomplishment for me. Also, even though I'm binging a bit sometimes, I'm finding it easier to eat less fruit, nuts and seeds, and to eat more vegetables, especially raw. Raw, 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 raw. Also, I'm sticking with my psyllium shake every morning, and that really helps absorb toxins and reduce enemas. Additionally, my body is releasing, my waist is getting smaller, and I'm getting these triumphant feelings all over. Get out of my way, laughing out loud. <laughs> so, 2016 was another pretty tough year for me. I would say probably not quite as tough as 15 in regards to all of the purging of toxicity that I've done from this body. But <laughs> the tightness that I had in my leg muscles, oh my god, they were so painful. There were weeks that I had to do rolling. I had to roll on those Lana rollers on my legs every couple of hours to dig the pain out of them. I had so much fucking pain. There were days that I had to do two enemas in a day. Two. It wasn't enough just to do one in the morning. <laughs> and the smell, the smell, it smelled like, what was it? <laughs> I likened it to carpet and for something, something just, it was just fucking toxic. And and now I'm like seeing more light. Like all of a sudden, in the last couple of months, see, I had this filling fall out of this tooth and I got all this jaw pain. And I made a video about that recently. It was about a couple, two or three weeks ago. And so I'm like, okay, well let's go for it again and see if we can do some of those anti-fungal bacterial herbs, you know? Because I really like to save this tooth. And before, I've, I've had other teeth pulled, and I tried to do that before, and I just got too sick. I've tried to do those herbs for different reasons in the past, and it would just overload me because I was all ready for all the different things that I do, all the different healing things that I do. It would overload me too much because I was just already moving out so much crap that I couldn't handle it. Now I am, and it's such a good sign. Oh my God, is it a good sign that I can do this stuff now. And I'm starting to be able to exercise again. Since I moved here two years ago, I've not done anything pretty much but just walking. Just to keep, you know, some good cardiovascular exercise going, and that's it. No yoga. No running, no, and nothing too extreme, no bicycle, hardly, hardly any bicycling really. And now it's all starting to come around and I'm just excited. I'm excited. And so there you have it. I hope this inspires you. I know it's taken me a long time, but that shows you that Patience and perseverance is possible. Three P's there. P.
patience, persistence, and it's possible. And it builds strength. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger. It's absolutely true. So keep at it, y'all. And remember, if you, if you do all those things that I outlined in that last video, the cancer video, it goes for everyone and everything. And to be able to get this lifestyle in a place where there's clean air and clean well water and you have access to clean food, preferably you can grow your own. Achieving this, this is where it's at. This is where it's at for health and prosperity in the future. Bad air and bad water, it just makes you weaker in all regards. And we have these new things, these internet things, that are going to enable us to get away from that for which is killing us. We can do it.